In 2024 alone, nearly 20,000 women will be diagnosed with ovarian cancer, according to the American Cancer Society. This is just one of the five gynecological cancers that can target women's reproductive systems. While cancer alone is an unpleasant experience, the side effects of treatment can often make it even harder to cope with. We're really focusing more on how do we improve quality of life during treatment and can that lead to improved quality of life even after treatment. Oncologist Eleanor Toplinski, head of breast and gynecologic medical oncology at Valley Health Systems in New Jersey, said although treatments haven't changed, the effects in which treatments can have on patients is something that has been studied for years. We think about chemotherapy, right, that comes to mind for everyone is hair loss and that's a really very, that's often one of the most difficult parts of the treatment for some people because it's an outward, you know, it's what people can see. But thanks to advanced research, the option of Paxman scalp cooling during chemotherapy treatment has helped to alleviate some of that worry. Some studies have shown too that even if the actual scalp cooling maybe is not as effective as we would like it to in the, in the short run, it actually helps hair regrow faster after the treatment ended. Another common side effect, especially in drugs used for ovarian cancer, is neuropathy, which is pain, numbness, or tingling in the fingers and toes that oftentimes is debilitating. And in this study, which is called the ICE Compress trial, they're actually testing a uh, cryocompression device. The current study is called the ICE Compression trial, where they are applying cryo and compression therapy to the extremities to reduce the risk of neuropathy. If you or someone you know is battling cancer, Dr. Toplinski urges people to talk with their oncologists about the benefits of Paxman's advanced technologies. Reporting from Rylander, Shauna Johnson, Newswatch 12.